This, this is my body. This is my blood. Remember me by doing this. Praise God. Hallelujah. The Thursday before the Resurrection Sunday, many people call it the Maundy Thursday. I call it the Communion Thursday. Why? Because Jesus celebrated the Passover meal. He broke the bread on that particular day and he gave it to his disciples. He even gave it to Judas, the one who was supposed to betray him. And further on, he washes the feet of his disciples. Why does he do it? Because he loves them. He wants to demonstrate his great and mighty love towards his disciples. The next day, Jesus was supposed to be crucified. He's not worried about that, what is going to happen tomorrow. But all he knows is, let me demonstrate my love to my disciples. And in fact, further on he says in John, I give you a new commandment. Love one another as I have loved you. Church, today we are called to love one another. No matter how much enemies are against you, continue to love them. Continue to love the ones who are doing bad things to you, who are speaking evil against you. Continue to love them because that's what God wants us to do. Show His great and mighty love towards the world outside. The world today, day by day, it's getting filled by hate. But you and me, we are called to love those people. I believe love never fails. And it's only through love people change. And Jesus demonstrated his great love, not only by his words, but by his actions towards us. I believe as you are celebrating this day, keep meditating on his great love for what he has done for you and for me. And I believe we'll experience the goodness of God. Do not be sorrowful on this day. Instead, rejoice for Jesus has shown us what we need to do. God bless you and have a blessed day.